Today I'm going to show you how you can upload your photos and videos onto your Kizo account. As you can see, I'm already in my Kizo account and I already have created a new photo album which I titled Wedding because I'm going to be uploading pictures from my friend Elizabeth's wedding onto this uh, album. So you'll see right away that there's a large green button in the center that you can use to upload your photos and videos or you'll always have this second button up here that also lets you upload your photos and videos. So I'm going to go ahead and click on this large green one and right away you'll see that you'll have the option to either choose the photos and videos from your computer or you can just easily retrieve all the photos and videos from your Facebook account onto your Kizo account. I'm going to go ahead and choose the My Computer option and I already am open to my photos. Um, so there's several ways you can go about doing this. You can either choose a photo at a time you can choose several at a time by holding the control key and clicking on the ones you want. Or you can choose all of them at once by using the control and A keys. For a Mac computer, the control will be the shift key or the command and A button, which will allow you to select all of them. So I'm going to go ahead and just upload this first row of photos. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and click on the open button down here. And as you can see, I now have a new window that shows me the progress of upload for each of the photos. After a while, uh, this window will minimize, or you can minimize it by clicking on that button, and it'll appear in the upper right hand corner over here, letting you know how much is left to go. Uh, this is pretty useful because that means you can go and back to your kids account and continue working on something, and you don't necessarily have to wait for all the photos to upload before you can uh, move along with your uh, creation. So the photos are almost done uploading. Only a few more seconds to go and there we go. Now that they're done uploading I'm given the option to either make a slideshow with them, I can make a collage, or I can continue adding more photos and videos. So that's it. It's pretty easy. See you on the next tutorial.